the kind of thing that surprises you when someone else says to you, did you see Doctor Who? And you're kind of like, well, yes, yes of course I saw it. But did you? But how come you did? <laughs> yeah. do, do you really want to have a conversation with me about Doctor <laughs> exactly. Who? Exactly. We're going to be on different levels on this one, it's aren't we? It's that kind of thing. <laughs> we always turn off for the next time. Do you really? Yeah, yeah. as soon as the episode finishes... We step away from next time. Oh, so if it's a two, if it's a two part, hardcore. If it's if it's a single standalone <laughs> episode and it's just like, oh, where, what adventure are they going to have yeah, next? Yeah, 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 yeah. Then yeah, fine. Bring up, bring on the next time. So yeah. we want to know what's going on. We're just going to talk bollocks for and we're about say an hour. Bollocks as well. Yes, that's Aren't the other you thing. You're all lucky. <laughs> <laughs> There's no point growing up if you can't be childish sometimes. Yeah, exactly. Yes. And say Willie. To quote the man yes. himself. So lots of Willies. Um, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> the lots of Willies. Well, I haven't got lots two. of Willies. <laughs> well. There's two in the room. You've only got one each. Is two lots of woolies? I don't know. Is, is two is a pair. Of, some kind of collective pair of woolies. Two is a pair. So we have a pair of woolies and a pair of breasts in the room That's right true. now. Yes. But I still believe the Jaguar Fest is a a manifestation of Russell T. Davis's fear of vaginas. There was a little shop in this guard and he had a few Doctor Who DVDs, so every time I had a little bit of money, usually lunch money, so I didn't bother eating, I just went and picked up what I could from his shop until you I still cleared do him that. out. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, I spend it on food. And then you come home and you go, Oh, I'm really hungry, I haven't eaten anything today. And I was like, Whose fault is this? Because I bought stuff. Yeah. <laughs> I like stuff. And then he moans at me until good. he gets fed. Yeah. I didn't really understand the Watcher stuff. I really don't. I can't get my head around it. The Watcher? So he was the doctor, doctor all after the all. Time. What? How do you know this? Why, 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 why makes that make sense? What kind of leap of logic is that? Exactly. Crazy woman? <laughs> How about, oh my god, that guy's going to stand on the doctor? <laughs> He's already ill. Let's keep him away. Exactly. Just I would rather Patrol. watch The Happiness Only Patrol than do sit that. down and watch your average episode of EastEnders. Mm. Oh my god, yes. Yes, or The X Factor for that reason. For yeah. That matter. And that gets about 20, 12 million viewers every bloody week. A nice man at the counter who actually said to me, I can't believe this is still on the show because it's a really really good price so yeah. that kind of you know because I was I, back then I was kind of a little shit I was like, yes, I guess so I'm buying dots Doctor Who <laughs> literally yeah. worse than porn it was literally <laughs> buying yeah it was literally worse than porn <laughs> yeah, I'll have this video of Doctor Who and these two jizz mags and then I'll just <laughs> put them in like the like a Doctor Who sandwich <laughs> exactly yes no I'm just buying a lot <laughs> of porn <laughs> It was literally, it was the, the wilderness years, come on, Doctor Who yeah. was seen as very kind of like, oh, there are shaky sets and bad acting and everything. Yeah. <laughs> Who would really go off with Brian Blessed? Anybody? Yeah. Come on. I'd go off with Brian Blessed. Yeah, exactly. Really? He's Brian got, Blessed propositions you, would beard. you seriously say no? I don't think you would be allowed. Yeah, no, I, I don't I don't think the universe would, would allow <laughs> Brian Blessed's beard and my beard to exist in the same room at the same time. I, I, I think we would have some kind of event incident there. The doctor would turn up and save the day. Yes, it's okay. that's true. No, no. Doctor Who and the beards. <laughs> the beard of the run. The, the beard of the run. <laughs> Reverse of polarity of the beard. <laughs> one, one positive beard, one anti-beard. Together, they neutralise each, each other. Out. But why can't we go to the Horsehead Nebula Doctor? Yeah. <laughs> well, because... Hopefully in a less this, masculine this, this. way. But why? But why cannot we go? It could be Turlo, I don't know. <laughs> oh, Harry, have you been on the hormones again? <laughs> no, Doctor. <laughs> you can play the points game with this as well, because if we ever forget the name of an episode, we will just describe it as vaguely as possible. Oh, yes. And if you get it before we do, you earn yourself one point. Anyone gets ten points, they can have a prize from us. No, they can't. Well, we haven't, the prize well, we haven't said what the prize will be yet. It'll be kudos. Yeah. yeah we'll, we'll, send, we'll send them a little card that Mention says, I've gained kudos from one man in the TARDIS. <laughs> Hello there. Hello there. We like Dr. Rue down here. Oh, uh. But then again, I mean, Donna's story ends on a bloody tragedy. Really, you know, he has to wipe her entire memory, and if she ever remembers, she'll he die. doesn't have to. No, if, if you remember, she begs him not to. Yes, and generally, girls and boys, when someone begs you not to do something, it's probably because you're about to rape them, and you should stop. <laughs> Mind rape is still rape. Mm -hmm. yes. <laughs> I did buy her Earth Shock eventually. Really? When New Who co came on, she got got into that quite bigly. Bigly? Bigly. Oh God, I've only had two. Well, invent words. <laughs> It'll be great! One man and his TARDIS facilitating fellatio. <laughs> That's a good tagline. <laughs> it's not accurate, but it's, no, it's not accurate. Yeah, but one of taglines ever been it's accurate. It's not accurate, that's true. By the way, we are recording this about an hour before the transmission of the Wedding of River Song. Ooh. So, Is that what it's called? The, the Wedding, wedding of, of River wedding, Song. Wedding. Wedding. <laughs> the Wedding of River Song. Oh, oh, I want to be there for the Wedding of River Song. Oh, 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 oh,
I was going to say you could dig a hole in the ground because the yeah. earth is the oldest thing oh. around. Ooh. We've got all new agey. Yeah. <laughs> and I went for an incest joke. <laughs> yes. I yes, I think I win that. Yes. All the Tor- Torchwood fans are actually screaming. I didn't really. I only watched Torchwood once. Well, all four of them. <laughs> oh. But then the Doctor does play the facade of the Fool. Yes. Very well. I mean, you, you just look at uh, Troughton, and that was the perfect example yes, of. That's true. <laughs> Oh, I'm a crazy little idiot. Look how I dress, oh, and oh, I've got a flute. But then deep down inside, then, look, he's, I've accidentally he's scuppered more your vicious. plans for that. <laughs> oh, <trying>. Darn. <laughs> I wouldn't say it was that far fetched for the doctor Just, to say, well, what happens when I get shot <laughs> is that yellow light Gold streams glowing. out of anywhere yeah. that, that has got a clothes orifice. <laughs> One thing that I really want to do and have, have done since Science in the Library is go, right, okay, River Song, let's watch you in your order. <laughs> and then yeah. sit down and do a definitive list and go, right, okay, so we start <laughs> off with River Song as a baby, that mm-hmm. episode, and then, then we get Let's Kill Hitler. And we go on and we watch all the episodes with River Song in it <laughs> up until we get to Science in the Library. Library and, of the Dead. and watch it from River Song's point of view and mm-hmm. see how clever Moffat really is. <laughs> that would be Does cool. it still all make sense? What's wrong with that? And I thought, it just makes him sound like a cock. But we say things like that all the time. <laughs> this whole podcast is going to make us sound like cocks. We're still not, like, by and large, yeah, we're nice but... people. The apologising, the constant, yes. unrelenting apologising. I'm sorry. I'm, sorry. I'm, so, I'm so, so sorry. sorry. I think it's just the, that bad taste that left that's left in your mouth. Yes, exactly. If you went, if you went for an, an amazing meal at a perfect restaurant and then they brought out mints... And the that were, were horrible. Yeah, were that would be the poo- last thing. Poo yeah. mints. Poo mints. <laughs> if you were expected to eat poo mints, <laughs> no, not expected. Not knowing they were poo mints. Not knowing they were poo. Fair enough. Put, pop them in your mouth. And you go. Oh, that was a lovely meal. I'll just finish it off with this mint. Oh, it's poo. <laughs> oh dear. It's a poo mint. <laughs> you're not gonna. Go, you're not gonna go back to that restaurant. No, exactly. You're not gonna remember the good food. You're going to remember the poo mints. <laughs> Yes, <laughs> David, David Tennant, Tennant the is doctor. A poo <laughs> <laughs> no, no, not even David Tennant. No, not Just even the David last Tennant. couple of episodes. Yes, yes. 